Believe it or not, we only have one day left of training camp. I'm sure it'll be a relatively short practice since everyone has been stuck in a hotel and want to return to the family. Let's hope the Raiders finish camp strong and figure out our defensive secondary. The biggest news, as usual, is injuries. Gerion Conley, Jihad War, Ben Heaney, and Denver Kirkland are all still out. It sure seems like Conley is going to miss all of his first year training camp. By all accounts, he's still involved in getting all the mental reps he can. That's great and all, but those missed reps are valuable for a rookie. There's still three weeks until camp, and Conley still has time to get his reps. Hopefully, he catches up fast and can contribute early in the season. In good news, the big stars of Khalil Mack and Amari Cooper are back at practice. Even though the injuries were considered minor, it's still great to have them back on the field. They should play for the next two preseason games to really prepare for the season. I'm not too worried about their missed practices. They're veterans and know how to take care of the body and will be good to go once the regular season starts. And now for some not so good news. Obi Milanfumu is officially not out of practice, but he's not doing anything. He'll warm up and maybe go through individual drills, but is held out of team drills entirely. We need him to contribute early in the season and he's practically learning a new position. As we can see from the preseason game, the Raiders need help covering tight ends in the middle of the field. Priority is health, but two rookies expected to contribute this season missing most of camp is concerning. And now for some good news. Shalom Nuwani continues to make plays as a safety. He continues to be around the ball and just makes plays. He's had a very good showing in his first preseason game and continues his strong training camp. He's taking full advantage of the reps he's given and looks like he's going to make the team. If he continues strong play throughout the preseason, there's no reason he won't be on the field during the regular season. Sean Smith is looking to turn things around after a few good practices. Let's not pretend Smith has a good start to the season, but with 9.5 million guaranteed, he needs to find a role. During camp, he's done well in coverage when facing bigger wide receivers such as KJ Brent and Michael Crabtree. On Wednesday, he made a good play deflecting the ball for a turnover. Let's remember, he's 6'3 at 220 pounds. He might be the best player to cover tight ends since he can match up well and covering quick receivers isn't what he does best. For the big news, the Raiders are about to open their home preseason against the Rams. They're pretty bad in terms of offense and the Raiders should have a better defense. Todd Gurley is the only known weapon for the Rams offense and the line isn't too good at opening holes for him. If the Raiders are dominated on defense again, there needs to be major changes.